Welcome to my Linux Mint 18 Sera. We have uh, another project. We have installed a new icon theme, Oranicello, which is um, this one, but there is a but. I have installed it on my Linux Mint 18 Sera, and some of some of the icons were missing. So you can install Oranicello via the scripts of themes icons pack on my github and some of them are missing like 10 plus or so icons there are really gaps inside it there are also old icons coming from the mint icon team and we have changed the script so that it inherits the icons from surfen and there's this github from me and so it's going to get all the icons that are missing will be coming from the surfing icon thing so that's what we're looking at now so orangello and we have here an arc dark evil pop active meaning that we have already changed the arc theme to a color we like more and we have uh, changed it to the evil pop color but as you can see there is still a little bit of difference i did also a test i think earlier on and as you can see the color of the Malibu is this one and the color of Astral is this one so it's it's quite different next to each other so the question is can we make a mint white theme with this kind of color orange shell color so okay let's do that how should we proceed we should go to the internet and there you have the mint y theme colora this is a way to run scripts change the color from the mint y theme coming from github from horst from the creator and then we run some scripts and we have a mint y theme that's up to date of course today with the code of today and then uh, we'll go on from there so copy to clipboard that's one thing we go to our wallpaper and press right mouse click open in terminal we git clone it if you don't have git clone let's not pretend that you have so sudo apt install git you have to have you have to write the password <laughs> and then git clone paste there she is, all the code, mint white color theme, all the scripts you're gonna need are here. That's one thing. Is there something else you'll need? Let's scroll down here. All the things you can just download, the themes you are on this GitHub. So everything we, every script we run, I'll put it online so you just, you can just download it. So what do we have to do? We have to install git, done that. We have to get the mint white theme, didn't do that, copy. We have to get the mint white colora theme, I did do that. So next up is back in our terminal, copy paste, git clone me everything that's coming from mint. So that's the source, done. What's next? Then you have to copy paste the four scripts from Mint Y Colora team into the folder of Mint Y team. So let's take a look. That's exactly correct. Mint Y Colora team to Mint Y team. Fine. And let's change wallpaper. Alt D, shortcut. Mint Y Colora team. And then we have this, copy it to the desktop, mint y team, paste in here. These scripts here are all going to look into a folder called source. So if you put these scripts somewhere else, it will not work. So up here, change color is the first thing we have to do. I did a gpic before. So what you do, you take the color, sudo apt install gpic, and then you take um, 
a swatch here and you hover off over something that you think is the color of these icons I do believe this one and this one is the same but we go if we go over this one it will come become lighter so this one is okay for us and this is the deep sky blue and this used to be Malibu you see there is a difference so let's try again does it differ right it's deep sky blue so this must be something else so this icon color should be this icon color if we are in doubt and actually I am in doubt and I want to make it correctly so I go to orange yellow itself to the icons itself I choose folders maybe as best place places scalable and I hope yes there are SVGs when you double click them I have it opened as a picture so I want to open it with something else Inkscape and then we're really sure if we press Control and on the color we ask here in this icon what color is it and this should be the color 4A so a completely different kind of color so I was as you can see we can change it here so that was the color okay no close without saving so this is the color inside of my Control C I've just done that so we have it with us not necessary anymore we'll see if it differs from this one let's keep it open and then mint white team is open there it is change the color not here sorry we should of course not 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 there as well let's go we've closed it okay so mint white team this is the folder we're working on on our desktop desktop mint white team change color sorry for the confusion change color and then we display opening on the other uh, screen Oopla. and there we have it and you have put your color codes in here and do not change the rest okay that's quite clear so we're gonna copy paste it here do forget the FFs if you're coming from um, from Inkscape like I, like I did now if you coming from JPEG it has a hashtag in front forget the hashtags this is the only code you're gonna need now there are two things you can uh, mint why team has a dark well they have, they have a mint why they have a mint why dark and a mint why darker so he uses two kind of colors so you can make it a little bit darker the blue or a bit lighter it's whatever you want to do or if you do just like me that's fine too so two times the same color all the colors in the folders will change and every color I have found every kind of variation of color I'm found I've well made a variable of it and it's going to be changed into a color so it's flattening actually the, the color uh, palette okay save we're gonna run the change color scripts but let's do it like this so we see all the text I have typed for you guys all colors in the folder source are still the original green ones from github change your color that will replace the green online or with tools like cheekpick changing done all CSS files but also SVG files will be affected PNGs will not be altered okay so how do we fix the PNGs by deleting them we do two deleted all PNGs have been deleted script three making the assets it's time for you to take a coffee it will take as long as it takes depending on CPU etc installing all needed software to be able to run the scripts yes scripts do have some information of course you need Inkscape OptiPNG Ruby Ruby SES is going to be installed and like I said it's not a joke you should go and wonder about I think he's starting here I'm not sure there is also an arc theme there he starts in the gtk2 and in the mint y he starts at the gtk3 
as you can see all the icons are built now extracted from where may be interesting but that's stuff for another movie this is the assets SVG which is all the blue you want and um, let him work as you can see he has a lot of work to do he has to fill this one but not only this one also this one this is now empty and he'll get it from here and from here let's pause the movie okay in the meantime the script has uh, ran and we have now script number four to install it as you can see everything has been built here and SVGs have been exported and converted to SVGs which is great so the thing to do now next is um, moving the themes so arrow up this is the last one we ran and we're gonna take the fourth one moving the themes so it's going to put the themes in a specific folder in our own personal themes because at this point they are in here and of course we want to be able to use them and select them so doing this let us rename the folders so they're unique your name will be added after the mint y the mint y dark mint y darker for instance if i type sun it will be mint y sun this is made for orange yellow let's have a quick look to see that we don't write it wrong otherwise we'll have to do it again Screen fetch orange yellow. Here it is. I can copy paste it as well, of course, but let's just type it orange yellow. That's the way to write it orange yellow. So now it will be called mint y orange yellow, and then I'll know when I'm using when I'm using the icons from orange yellow. I will use also the mint y orange yellow. All right so this should be gone let's run it okay rename the folders rename the content of index time a theme to this and inside of the themes as well things have been changed let's have a look so themes let's go for oran cello and there they are so not only the fold are the folders changed which is good enough for us on linux mint but also on index theme you can open them and you'll see that it has also the name inside of it so that uh, xfce is also working with this theme and now there's only one thing to do and that will conclude the movie let's select the thing There are three choices choices you can make so there are a lot of arcs i've created as you can see and there are a lot of mints i've created and there is now one more and uh, looking for it so um, i always choose the mint white dark but you have also the mint y orange yellow mint white dark orange yellow and mint white darker orange orange yellow so there are three kind of orange yellows but i choose this to use this one mint y dark scroll down orange yellow and then the arc dark is going out and we're going to use the mint white dark orange yellow so this is what you get this color here that color here that should be the same if we open we should have the same kind of accents here 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 as you can see uh, quite quite inter interesting to see that orange yellow has an uh, completely different kind of look when you press this buttons here so it's quite playful i think the theme and all icons f now of all applications have an icon due to the fact that we have changed orange yellow a little bit when you download it from github from my github not from orange yellow's github then i will add this kind of line so it's inheriting all the icons that are missing for uh, Linux Mint. It's coming from Surfing. It's about 10 plus icons that are not showing up on Linux Mint. So he's really getting all the icons that are missing 
from this one, Surfing. And Surfing can be found on my uh, GitHub here. So this is Surfing and all the icons that are missing for paper and for orange yellow, both of them. I've added this little, little word, inherits Surfing. All right, so this is our result. I uh, hope you like it and I hope it's, it's easy. I hope it's, it's applicable, you can use it. And uh, when you have a wallpaper you like or an icon theme you like or a wall and then a conky you like, you can change colors now via this little script and um, enjoy.